the Mickelson Morley experiment in one minute. Mickelson and Morley believed that there was an ether against which all speeds could be measured. They believed that the Earth's motion through the ether affected the speed of light in the direction of Earth's motion. Here's the experimental setup. The light beam was split into two and each beam reflected off a mirror before returning to the observer. The beams of light travelled the same distance through glass and air. What they expected was for the light beam travelling parallel to the Earth's motion through the ether to travel at a different speed to the light beam travelling perpendicular. The difference in times taken for each light beam to reach the observer meant they arrived out of phase, producing an interference pattern. Rotating the apparatus by 90 degrees would change this time difference and change the phase difference between the two light beams, so the interference pattern shifted. Their instruments had a large enough resolution to measure their expected change, but what they actually observed was no shift, no matter when or how they rotated the apparatus. So they concluded that there was no ether and the speed of light in free space was invariant for all observers.